Hi everyone, this is Killshot from 99 Gaming. I want to do a video for Star Wars Galaxy of Heroes, and this is called Darth Sidious and Captain Phasma Promotions. So uh, I wanted to give you guys just a little sneak peek into my team and a little bit of stuff that I've been doing behind the scenes. I know I haven't posted a lot of these videos, but a couple of my subscribers left comments and said, ideally you really want to focus on five or six characters just to make sure you build that team because the training bots get so expensive later on then uh, you can't really afford to get 15 or 20 characters at one time. So this is my kind of key five or six, and first and foremost is Darth Sidious. You can see I've been farming that uh, with some arena, the uh, shards in the arena, um, and finally got him up to five star there. So nice stat increase there, 31, 50, and 27, a little bit of increase of power. Nice thing about this as well, too, is when he before I upgraded him, uh, when he was four star, all those level three abilities were, that's the highest I could get them. So now you can see I can go back and increase his, uh, demor his death stroke, demoralizing blows, a couple other things as well too, uh, to get him up a little bit higher. I still need to farm a few of the uh, materials, but I'm trying to farm for a lot of people. And you can see now to go from uh, five star to six star, I need to get 85 shards. So it's going to take me a little bit of time uh, to get that in arena rewards every day. But... Uh, it's all right. I'm determined, and i got a little bit of time. So at least the nice thing about this game is you have a path in order to get there. You don't have to wait on just some RNG or just some random luck. So uh, that's a little bit of my team there. It's my first five star. i got Chewie at four stars. i got Kylo at four. i got Luminara up to four. And Captain Phasma and Count Doku uh, and the Jedi Consular are really the next three. Uh, Poe, I was lucky to get him, and I got the shards pretty early. But I haven't done a lot with him yet. But you can see Captain Phasma, i got 25 out of 30. And show you a little bit of the uh, abilities there. And if I go to the Galactic War shipments, and we've already reset the timer, you can see I've done my Galactic War for today. So I've got 400 gems available. And that's going to give me just enough shards in order to get Captain Phasma up to the four star. So it'll make my core team all four star. So I'm kind of looking forward to uh, running through and getting some stuff on there because I am on the uh, Cantina kind of stuck on the last fight on the third wave, which is funny because that's Count Do uh, Doku, and it's an elite boss. But I want to get to the fourth uh, arena or um, squad cantina battle because then I can start unlocking the uh, Kylo Ren shards. So, you know, these two upgrades are definitely going to help my team. So now I've got Darth at a five-star, Captain Phasma at four-star, and go back farm a few more materials. Chewbacca, he's going to be kind of in and out. Ultimately, I'll probably get Count Doku in there and, and go without a tank a little bit later on. And I've also got the uh, Jedi Consular as well, too, that up in there as a sub. So this is a little bit of my team. I'll work a little bit more behind the scenes. And when I get a little higher level, I'll definitely do more of these videos for you guys. Thanks so much for watching. My name's Killshot. Peace.